We've got brand new mystery boxes. I know nothing about these going in totally blind. They could either be great or they could be horrific. Two hobby packs, which is interesting. I mean, they were 20, so they were $20 a box, but the hobby packs are Topps Finest and Bowman U Basketball. So unlicensed hobby boxes, I guess. And Wembenyama on the front with including one game user autograph card. Okay. So Wembenyama on the front with some random grading company. I, I, I don't know. They're only 20 bucks, so can't hurt. But because they're only 20 bucks, guessing don't expect too much. But who knows? Maybe every once in a while they throw the dog a bone. So let's do this. Should be interesting. All right, so at least they told the truth. Oh, oops. At least they told the truth about Topps Finest and Bowman Basketball. But Prism Draft and then Pro Picks, which is unlicensed garbage. So save these hobby packs for last. And we get this random little black box of cards. Let's see what this is. Okay, Chad Holmgren, Block Party. I don't know what set this is from, but whoa, look at that. Kevin Garnett, Hardcourt Materials, Upper Deck. That is honestly really cool. We received a game-used trading card from Kevin Garnett, game-used. How cool is that? On, wait, wait, hold on. What year is this? 2006. So that that's honestly really cool. I For 20 bucks, I think, uh, I don't know what that's worth, but I mean, 20 bucks, that's pretty cool. And then Jordan Hill and just some random, this is 2013, and then some base cards. All right, yeah, just some base Let's do these Pro Picks 2021. Five cards and one hollow star. I don't know what that means, but... All right. The hollow Benedict Maturin. I'll just try to get through these quick because there are a couple of them. And no one, I know nobody really wants to see these, but who knows? Maybe they throw an auto in here or something. Get to those hobby packs. It is the first year Bowman U basketball, which is unlicensed and looks really cheap and gross, but hobby packs, so maybe we could pull an auto. Luther Muhammad. Yeah, don't care. And a Prism Draft Picks pack. Funny enough, I just opened this, oops, I just opened this for the current year, right? So, Boop Knight and Paul George. So, I just opened draft picks for this year with Wembenyama, and I pulled that Red Ice Wembenyama. I sold it for $105. So, I decided to sell it because I looked online at what, just, just found like another star, so an Anthony Edwards Red Ice Draft Picks Prism is currently selling for $3, but someone thinks a Wembenyama for $105 was a good purchase. Uh, God bless him. Let's get into box number two, see if it's all the same. It is, okay, it's not all the same. We get Bowman, Don Russ, Finest, and then Pro Picks. All right, let's just get these out of the way. If there, if there's, I don't even, is there even autos in this? I can honestly just skip this stuff. I hate making you guys have to sit through this. There's Jeremiah Robinson Earl. It's a, this one was purple or something, I don't know. But yeah, nothing. Just try to. To get through this quick, same exact cards.
And another <laughs> Jeremiah Robinson Earl. Great. So now you know. If you see these pro picks at Walgreens, yeah, you don't need it. Another Jeremiah Robinson Earl. Great. Okay. Seems like I should save this for last because they put the hit in there. All right. Don Russ. I don't even know who to look for. I guess Paulo Bencaro is like the only one. Trey Mann. Gross. Bowman U Hobby Pack. Oh, we actually get a numbered card here. Jalen Wilson from Duke. I believe he's in from Duke. It's a cool picture and cool. I think that's to 99. Yeah. 93 of 99. Nice numbered card. And then Top's Finest. I don't know who to look for in these. But it's cool. It's Hobby Packs. A Refractor. <laughs> Latrell Spruill. Refractor. Allen Houston. Percy Hawkins. Yeah, I could go. I could go without those. All right, let's see what is in this. Wow, a lot thicker in here. Ooh, what is this? Gabe Pruitt. SP Upper Deck. Wow, that is signature threads. I don't know what that's worth. Probably not much, but. Game worn patch auto rookie photo, huh? It, this is a sick looking card. I mean, what year was this again? 2007, 2008. Gabe Pruitt, very random, but it's an auto patch auto. And then, oh, I already see that flux appeal Steph in the back here. Yeah, the the black box is definitely the better of the things to open, but Flux Appeal Steph, I really like this card. And let's look through the rest here. Gary Trent, Corey Kispert, some Chronicles, Scotty. All right. We got one more. That's honestly for 20 bucks, pretty fun. Seems we've been blessed with mystery boxes lately. They've actually been good between this and the basketball, I mean, or the uh, baseball ones. Pretty good lately. All right, which packs? Pro picks. Finest. All right, same as the first. Get these out of here. All right. Damian Collins. Yeah, if you're, if you're just skipping through here or on two times speed, can't say I blame you. Another Damian Collins, and let me guess. Three times the charm, Damian Collins. How do they manage to do that where it's the same one in every single pack? All right, Prism Draft. I don't remember which one had the orange ice, so I don't know if this is like Mega Box or Blaster or what. Trey Young, Jalen Green, orange. Guess that's okay. Again, probably goes for like two or three bucks, but whatever. All right. Bowman basketball. Just a bunch of paper and tops finest. Anything good in here? Horace Grant, Cole Anthony, Vince Carter. <laughs> Look at these pictures. What the hell? It's like early 2000s, like, gangster rap vibes I'm getting from these. But all right, we got a black box. Let's see what our hit is. Chet Holmgren. And another, <laughs> another Kevin Garnett game-worn jersey. Ugh. So I'm guessing a lot of Garnett game-worn jersey cards in these. It was cool the first time, though. We'll see what we get in here. Rookie Bobby Hurley. Gerald, wasn't it Gerald Madkins? 
Celtics tradition still alive. What year are these from? 94. What is this? 94. And there you have it. So, honestly, pretty cool. 20 bucks. Can't hurt. I don't know. Really, it's just that the hit in the black box is your shot at really anything good. But uh, there you have it. Some game-worn Kevin Garnett cards. Legit game-worn, too. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. You guys going to try to find some of these for 20 bucks? I don't know. It was, it was kind of fun. I like mystery boxes. But uh, anyway, let me know what you guys think. Smash the like button for taking the uh, taking the uh, venture into uncharted territory for you all. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.